is my pleasure to present Pine Forge Academy's honorees for the National Honor Society and the Caring Heart Award. The National Honor Society, officially established in 1921 by the National Association of Secondary School Principals. This elevates a school's commitment to the values of scholarship, service, leadership, and character. Today, it is estimated that more than one million students participate in the National Honor Society activities. NHS chapters are found in all 50 states, U.S. territories, Canada, and around the world. Chapter membership not only recognizes students for their accomplishments, but challenges them to develop further through active involvement in school activities and community service. There are four pillars of the National Honor Society, scholarship, leadership, service, and character. Students who demonstrate scholarship are those who pursue academic excellence and achieve mastery of subject through diligent study. Students demonstrate service through volunteer contributions to the school or community and without compensation and with a positive, courteous, and enthusiastic spirit. Student leaders are resourceful, dependable, positive in their influence and those who motivate themselves and others to the highest level of accomplishment of duty. Students of good character uphold principles of morality and ethics, are cooperative, demonstrate high standards of honesty, and show courtesy, concern, and respect for others, and generally maintain a clear and consistent lifestyle. Congratulations to the following students on being accepted in the Pine Forge Academy chapter of the National Honor Society for the year 2019-2020. The North American Division sponsors the Caring Heart Awards, giving recognition to secondary students who have demonstrated a personal commitment to making the world a better place and sharing the love of God. Today, we honor Anaya Perry for her infectious and gracious spirit and her commitment to serving others. It is my privilege and honor to announce the quintessential class of 2020's valedictorian and salutatorian. I must say that all of our students are phenomenal. It has been our pledge to develop the talents and gifts that God has given each one. Ephesians 4, 11 and 12 states, and he gave some apostles and some prophets and some evangelists, and some pastors, and even some teachers. For the perfecting of saints, for the work of the ministry, and for the edifying of the body of Christ. Today we honor Aaron Harrell as valedictorian, and Grace Williamson as our salutatorian. Job well done, ladies.